Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an Alex and Annie collection video because I just recently noticed how many Alex and Annie bracelets I have and I really wanted to share them with you guys. I honestly don't wear them enough and I really should. I don't even know if Alex and Annie is still cool or not, but I really don't care because they're so cute and I like the designs. But as you can see, I have a ton of Alex and Annie bracelets here and I'm just going to share them with you today. Also, shout out to my cousin Perry for giving me this cute workout top. I don't really work out in it because as you guys can see, it's a little loose on the top, but overall it's really cute. So I just am wearing it as a top. So question of the day before we get started, what is your favorite Alex Nanny bracelet? Do you have an Alex Nanny bracelet? I would love to know. So anyway, let's get on with this video. So starting off, I have this bracelet. It is just a arrow sign a friendship bracelet and it's kind of rusty because i've had this one for a long time i used to wear this one a lot i will have a close-up of all the bracelets so you guys can see them but this is definitely a well-worn one when i did wear them a lot this is a rose gold mini ears bracelet it matches my ears my necklace everything i love this one um it just has some glitter and honestly this bracelet's held up for how long i've had it the next bracelet i'm showing you is my a bracelet and this is the very first Alex and Annie bracelet I got. I got it on the Disney cruise so it is pretty sentimental to me because I was like oh my gosh this is so cool and I really wanted it so I was on a Disney cruise and this was pretty much my souvenir that year. The next bracelet I'm showing you is this castle bracelet. It is the castle with Mickey holding Walt Disney's hand and I think I got this bracelet because Valerie and I always used to do that pose when we would come to Disney World when I was really little. So it kind of has that sentimental reason because Valerie loves this little statue pose picture. And we actually do have a Mickey and Walt statue that looks like that. The next bracelet I have is Anna and Elsa. And honestly, I think I got this with my cousin and our friend because we wanted something to like commemorate the day. So uh, we ended up getting these Frozen Anna and Elsa bracelets, which honestly I love Frozen, so I don't regret getting that one. The next one is probably one of my favorites because I love anchors and I think I got this one on a cruise as well. It's really worn as you can see, it's like tarnishing and stuff, but this is definitely one of my favorites. It's just an anchor. It has a see-through little charm, which I really like because it's not your stereotypical Alex and Annie flat disc charm. So I really like that. It's like 3D as well. It like pops out a little bit. The next bracelet I have is Chase Your Dream. And I don't know when I got this, but Valerie got this for me because she really liked the message. And that's kind of what I live by. Like I just go after what I want in life and see what happens. Um, this is actually from a run Disney because of the chase part, I think. I've never really partaken in a run Disney race, but I like the bracelet and the color. So I just got it. Okay. So the next bracelet is so cute and honestly you guys will be like why is this one your favorite or why is this one one of your favorites but it is this B for Bloomingdale's and I actually got this bracelet at Bloomingdale's obviously because you know they don't sell these anywhere else but um yeah it's just this B I love the font that Bloomingdale uses it's very clean sleek round I don't know I just love Bloomingdale's the department store it's really classy, bougie, all of that. So I love my bee bracelets. The next bracelet I'm showing you is this infinity sign one. And it's probably one of my favorites as well, just because my dance teacher got this for me for my senior year. And I wore this one a lot in the past. Um, so I did get some use out of some of these bracelets, but um, most of the time I just keep them in the in the bag just to keep as my collection. But this is definitely one of my favorites just because of that memory and um, dance was like a really fun time in my life. And just getting this from my dance teachers was really special and I like the design. And our little sign was like the infinity sign. The next bracelet is this Hollywood Studios one. And I really like this because it actually has the Mickey hat. And as you know, they have taken down the hat 
that used to be there. So I don't think they make these anymore. I love this bracelet just because we got it right before um, the hat went away. So maybe this might be worth something. I don't know in the future, but I'm glad I got it just to have the old symbol on something um, that represents Hollywood Studios. The next bracelet I got, I think I just got this one on Amazon. It is an Alex and Annie. So I don't know who the seller is and I don't even know if you can still get it. Um, but it is this unicorn gold bracelet. And I think I got this one because Aspen Ovard had it. And I really liked the unicorn because it was like pink and gold. And I thought that went really well together. I wore this one a lot with the silver arrow one um, because I really liked them together and everything. And then last but not least, this is my most recent bracelet and I really like it because it is from Pixar and as you guys know, I was a digital media major and I did a whole project about John Lasseter and him and the company Pixar. So I'm a big, big fan of the Pixar ball, whether or not that's nerdy or weird, but I love this thing. So for Christmas, my parents got me this fun Pixar, I think it's the Lumex ball. I don't know. I should know, but... They got me the little Pixar ball in a bracelet, in an Alex and Annie bracelet, and I absolutely love it. So that is all of my Alex and Annie bracelets. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was short and sweet, but I just noticed that I had so many and I wanted to share them with you guys. So anyway, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.